you're doing get out of here hey what's going on guys it is Zach or the firefly remedy and I've been playing some black ops 1 over the course of the last 24 hours really because my black ops 3 disc decided it didn't want to be readable anymore so I figured why the hell not let's hop on this game and try and get high up on the leaderboards so I've been playing a lot of search and destroy and as you can see right here I have a decent spot. I mean, I'd say the first dozen or so people are either one boosters, hackers, or they're playing in a party. So I don't really count those people because it's unfair to someone who plays solo like me. And with that, you're probably thinking to yourself, oh god, this guy's just trying to make excuses for himself. There's only like 3,000 people on the leaderboards for Search and Destroy Weekly, and you're number 45. You're trash. You suck, Firefly. But let me tell you something, guys. There's a reason why I chose this particular gameplay. And this is gonna be a rant. This is gonna be me complaining and showing you the bullshit I have to go through on a daily basis. In this Search and Destroy game, we lost. Yes, we lost in overtime. Four to three, to be exact. And you wanna know what I did to contribute to this team? Everything. I fucking contributed everything. And look at this little two-piece right here, man. I almost failed so hard, by the way. I should have died so easily, man. But I went 20 and 4 in this fucking game. And right here I failed. I should have just planted the bomb. They probably wouldn't have even noticed me. But I died. And that's the end of it. Um, yeah, 20 and 4. I had like 11,000 score. And I was pissed. And you want to know the funniest part? Here are the leaderboards after this game. Yes, it brought down my score per minute. How the fuck does that bring down your score per minute? You know, I understand this is a big ass map. It can be slow paced, but I got 20 kills. And in order to obtain and keep my spot in the mid 40s, I have to have like a 750 plus score per minute, which is like a kill and a half a round, or a kill and a half a minute. And it brought it down. Now, it makes me wonder to myself, hmm, how do people actually manage to stay high up on the fucking leaderboards without cheating, boosting, or playing in a party? I don't think it's really possible, minus a few exceptions. I'm gonna be honest with you guys. Yeah, real talk, real talk. I am a tryhard. Always have been, always will be. Every single day, I tell myself, hmm, you know, you're 21 years old, do you really need to be tryharding a first person shooter video game? I mean, don't you have better things to do? No. No. I, I, I really don't. <laughs> I just, I can't help it. I'll have days where I'm just screwing around, and that was a lucky-ass kill, by the way. Talk about horrible aim, but it somehow worked out. But I just cannot get around the fact that I will always be a tryhard, and I will always get angry at the game. I always think, you know, in time as I get older, I'm not really going to give as much of a shit. But I always do. I always get pissed off, even on these older-ass games. How old is this game now? Is that six years old? I made a video on this not too long ago, but... Ugh. 20 and 4. 20 and 4, guys. Come on. How the hell does everything just fall apart? How the hell do I get these teammates? And why the hell do I give a shit anymore? I don't know. <laughs> I've always tried to get high up on the later boards. This is nothing new. Maybe for the score per minute type deal, I kind of care more about it now than I did before. Uh, back then, like in Modern Warfare 3 or World at War, I played for the leaderboards for wins and kills and stuff like that, where, and by the way, this is a freaking fantastic spot. If you're ever playing Search and Destroy on this map, go to this spot. Plant the bomb right there. They're never gonna find you. Just put on a suppressor or something, you're good to go. It's, it's freaking fantastic. If you got some plebs on the other team, you're good to go, guys. Don't even worry about it. But seriously, um, playing for the leaderboards is what, it's always made the games fun for me. If there weren't leaderboards, I don't think I'd really play this game. 
I don't think I ever would have gotten into Call of Duty or just video games in general. I just always loved the aspect of multiplayer leaderboards. I'm, I mean, multiplayer hasn't always been around. When I was younger, I really enjoyed adventure games like Crash Bandicoot and stuff, but now I'm just like... It, the game doesn't really have a purpose unless I can be somewhat productive with it, and whenever I'm up on the leaderboards, I feel like I'm being productive, you know, I'm making use of my time, you know, if I'm gonna be good at something, I want people to know, I want something to show for it, and look at these two guys right here, they were having like a little tea party by the bomb, look how cute that is, aww, so cute, but take free run for example, a lot of my videos recently over the course of the last few months have consisted of free run, if there weren't leaderboards, I wouldn't be playing, I'll be honest with you. I was just playing solely for the leaderboards, as I'm sure most of the other top guys are. There's something about the leaderboards that is just... The icing on top. The cherry on top. And look at this guy running in from the napalm, he's like, OH SHIT! <laughs> but anyway guys, let's get back on track. It is overtime here. And I pop off two kills. I'm like, okay, we have a chance here. But no. My greedy, sorry ass went forward dead. Just dead. And you gotta always love to rely on your teammates. This guy was a treat to watch, let me tell you. And I'm gonna be honest, he was the second best guy on the team. Look at this. Look at it. He's right there. He's right there. Oh my god. I, I, rem I was just screaming to myself and... None of my teammates, they, they were all talking, but none of them seemed to have any idea what was going on. It, it was just... Why? Why does this happen to me? If you enjoyed the video, please like it, and hit that subscribe button. Tell your friends. More videos coming soon. Peace out.